Hey team, Mick here from Melbourne Soft Tissue Therapy. Now today for our mobility work, we're gonna go through some ankles to try and improve that uh, ankle range of motion for mainly the dorsiflexion, bit of plantar flexion. Basically gonna work around all the tissue around the ankle and try and give that a bit more range. So first one we always like to do to get some tension away from the bottom of the foot is your handy mobility ball. And we're just gonna mash out some of the tension stuck on the bottom of that plantar. So the best way to do this, Starting the ball outside your little pinky, so you can see half the ball, and put some good firm pressure all the way across. Nice and slow, as slow as you can really. We're going to do this a bit faster to show you. All the way to the other side, until you see the other side of the ball. Come back to the start, move a few centimeters down, and we go again. Keep your work away all the way down, until you get all the way to the heel and back. Once you get the heel, work your way back up to the top. Do that both sides. That's just going to get everything moving nice and easy. Second one. So we're going to work through tissue on the front of the, of the shin. A lot of people really don't realize how much muscle we actually got there. This muscle here, your tib amp, its job is to pull those toes up. So if that's all jammed up, we're not going to get any dorsiflexion. So get the ball again into that muscle. Find the crappy spots, you know, when you find them. Once you find one, just start moving the ankle up and around. This is a little bit easier on a bench or somewhere your foot drops off the edge. So you can move around a little bit easier, but work your way from top to bottom. Again, that's gonna give you some better dorsiflexion there. Now that we've worked on basic bit of tissue there, um, added one you can do is just for roll the the, um, the calves. No need to show you, that's pretty straightforward. And then one of the better ones, that can really help with that better dorsiflexion is grab yourself a power band, wrap it around something that's gonna quite hold it quite tight. Now with the band, make sure the band sits under the two ankle bones there don't sell at the top because that's just going to pull your ankle in the wrong position but we're trying to pull this bone what's called your talus right in the middle of your ankle there backwards so from here i'm just going to pop all my body weight onto my knee just come back a bit onto my knee and i'm going to push forward band's pulling you back you're going to get a good stretch through the calf and the achilles there and what we want to do you're going to push your toes into the ground keep your heel down push your toes to the ground should feel a bit of activation through the calf there. Hold for about five seconds and relax. Relax for about five seconds and then you're gonna pull your toes up. Again, you'll feel this relax. Hold for five seconds and relax. And keep doing that for about a couple of minutes. You'll find yourself just getting a little bit more range each time. Basically what we're trying to do, get some neuromuscular activity at the end of that end range. Okay, both sides. Last but not least, pretty straightforward. Just a simple calf stretch. So raise it up. Push that foot, knee, body weight over the calf, over the ankle, and now you can either do it with a straight leg or we can go from a bent knee, get more of that soleil. So, what I like to do is so a good four or five minutes each side, and from there, ankle should be nice and flexing. All right, have a good day.